morning, it's March 14th, Thursday, and uh, we've got uh, eight orders to do today. The first order here, I skipped yesterday, so the we can't count this again for today because we did count it yesterday, but that was like $74.66, 215 items, 69 lots, but uh, what we do have to pull today is 2,498 items, 147 lots, and $371.00. 42 cents so almost about $300 uh, today if we uh, you know we subtract 76 66 or 74 66 from uh, this number we get just under $300 so not a bad day not a bad day we had a couple of big ones here uh, $126.15 this is from my buddy that likes to ask for all the lots uh, bagged individually and he always comes back with a big order so you know, make make those make those customers happy. Sometimes you, you just got to do it. And then uh, and we've got a forty-four lot one for fifty-four dollars. We've got a six lot one for thirty-six dollars. Pretty nice, pretty nice orders. And then we've got this one up here. And uh, yeah, these two I think are the same person. Yes. Because uh, they ordered and then they messaged me and said that they forgot to do something. Can they just PayPal me? And I was like, oh, I'm not risking uh, breaking terms of service. So place another order and I'll refund you the, the shipping difference. So I do need to uh, refund that when I get a chance. So there we go. That's it. Let's get pulling. I might be biased, but I totally 100% am behind the statement. Thanks for the order. Appreciate it. As I probably alluded to in the last video, we got some mail in and uh, we're going to open it up right now. First package we're opening is that small box and uh, it was an eBay lot of minifigures. And I'm not expecting, uh, I bought this with the expectation of, I'll probably part up most of these uh, minifigures just because I didn't see any complete ones. but. I do see a couple of complete ones in here and they do look like they're in really good condition. So uh, this actually was probably a better better buy than I, I thought it was going to be. So so that, uh, that's something that will work on later. Let's, uh, let's open up this next package here. This is a resupply. This is another eBay order. Uh, I got the uh, two by three, actually just like this, the two by three little baggies uh, for packing up orders. Uh, there are, I think there's two, 1,000 in, yeah, 1,000 in each box, so there's 4,000 total. I've only got 1,000 left, and I just opened one. I opened, uh, one down there, and then I have one more 1,000 left, so this one's half, half gone, and then another one is on the shelf, so I thought I'd, uh, get this to hopefully should last another six months or so, and, uh, all right, let's open up the big one. All right, so this is a big order from my... <coughs> Polybag bag uh, supplier. I think these are all freebies because I didn't order these, but uh, Okatan Kreese uh, magazine paper bag, a uh, Marvel's Series 2 minifigure, and uh, another another tin, which actually haven't been selling. I think I have a couple of those still left, but those are all good. And then in here should be 120 poly bags. Everything we're gonna go through and get listed for sale. Oh yeah, these go. These go quick. These actually, I'm surprised at how how much they sell. Um, Ninjago always does well. This is a new one I haven't seen before. The, the, the Temple Battle always sells. I go through that quite a bit. The uh, McLaren sells pretty good. So all these are good so far. Oh, we got Easter bunnies. Get these up quick. Actually. I'll save this because I think I get one. Uh, I think I think I got one gift of purchase that come pretty soon. Uh, some Minecraft. Minecraft always does well. More speed champions. Another Formula One car. So lots of good stuff. A little, uh, I'll dump it out and go through it. There's a Dreams bag. Spider Escape. That one does well too. Uh, I don't think the Sonic has done so well. I think I've actually. No, I'll take that back. I think I've sold out of all that. So, so far, there's a, there's a space one down there. Yeah, let's go. Let's tump it out and go through it. 
get this to do this correctly so let's not screw this up. So just pour this right on the table. Oh, oh more freebies at the bottom. Nice, more books. Naya, Batman, Robin, and a uh, Harry Potter card and a uh, uh, Joker figure. Oh, video, video box. All good stuff in here. Friends Flower Garden. All good stuff. So far, everything I've shown you. Some city stuff, city police, off-road buggy car. Ooh, here's a new one. Venom Street Bike. A whole bunch of those. Space Hover Bike. Ooh, here's some Animal Crossing. Maple Pumpkin Garden. I think that's pretty much it. If I find anything else, I'll, I'll go through it. All of it is McLaren Formula One car. So, all right. I got. It. Guess what I'm doing this afternoon? This. Hila doesn't know what's going on. We've got 18 different poly bags. We got the uh, Easter one. We've got the uh, AT AAT. We got the uh, forklift with pallet. Miles or uh, the Venom. Miles. Venom street bike. Uh, the Perseverance. This one sells pretty good. Uh, a city police off road buggy car. Uh, three in, creator three in one uh, gift animals. It says looks like a dog, a koala bear. I don't know what that other thing is. Anyways, uh, space hover bike, dragons rising, uh, Zane's dragon, power vehicles, Animal Crossings, uh, the F1 Speed Champions car, the McLaren, Solus. Uh, Z Bob and Buncho's Spider Escape, and then we've got uh, Animal Birthday Party, Ninjago, Kai, and Rap Raptons uh, Temple Battle, a Friends uh, Flower One, Minecraft, and Sonic. Really good. Can't wait to get these uploaded. Here's a, a final look at all of the the freebies that the, my my uh, my guy sent as well. Uh, Naya, we got the uh, Batman and Robin with the uh, the card there I was talking about. The Joker figure, a tin, then Jago tin, video box, uh, Bo-Katan Kreez, and uh, Marvel series too. Really appreciate all that. I was uh, entering in the uh, poly bags into brick store and I was just sitting here I looked over to the bag here and I noticed that this lot has that uh, what is it a, the bard or whatever the thing that goes into the mouth of the tauntaun this is what I was looking for what a couple weeks ago too bad I sold the arms and um, one of the bodies already so I don't think I can complete a whole one yet but I'll take a look but that was what I needed to complete a whole tauntaun um, Last, last time I got Tauntauns in, so interesting. Well, I got them all uh, entered in here. It's uh, 119 uh, of them, uh, 18 lots, $532.69. I only had one still left. I, I mean, I've had a lot of these already, but uh, only the Z Blob and Buncho Spider Escape. I only had one left, so that's the only one. So 17 new poly bags to the store, and uh, that is fantastic and that uh animal crossing one is going for five dollars and 92 cents that's crazy that's craziness the space hover bike still going for almost five bucks the aat is 565 so pretty good pretty good stuff i just went in to go grab the uh the poly bin i call it i call this the poly bin it sits on the floor uh but this was holding all of the poly bins that i had this was jam-packed full at one point uh, in January when I already stocked it before. So I'm down to 
eight, nine, nine. I have nine poly bags left. I sold two uh, Batmans, 1989 Batmans today. Those were the last two I had. Where are they? Uh, where is that other drawer? I think it's in the other room. But I've, I've got some on shop.ralphsbricks.com as well. So, but uh, these two are going in here. And then the rest of them, maybe I can get them all shoved in here. Get all these new ones, or these older ones up front. And all the, all the older ones are going in the back. Or the newer ones are going in the back. I think this is an example of where brick stores, um, six months average pricing is going to not be the best for you. So obviously, like getting poly bags overseas is going to be a lot cheaper. Um, and... This, it's going to bring the six months average price down significantly. And so when I priced everything, I was getting like $530, um, which was like $130 of profit after I, I paid for every, what I paid for everything. And so I started, I went through each one and uh, I pulled up the, the price guide on each item. So here's like the Here's the, uh, what is this? The Animal Crossing poly bag. And I was obviously the cheapest um, for for everybody uh, on Bricklink, which is not, not the best place to be. So I did a group by currency, and I found that the uh, average price of uh, poly bags in the US that are selling is $11.25. I, I had it listed for like $5, and what I have it listed for? five something five five twenty nine I think and so even uh, even listing it at eleven twenty five only one other seller in the US is cheaper than me and not by much so I went through and did that with all of them and repriced um, manually and uh, I got the value now is uh, seven hundred thirty six dollars and fifty two cents so I was able to bring my value up of the poly bags by $200 just by going through and manually repricing. So don't always trust the six months average price. Um, when I've probably been doing that quite a bit with poly bags and I, I probably won't do that again going forward. Use it as a guide and then, uh, yeah, I'll check, I'll check the U S, um, average price on BrickLink itself. I'm going through the pile of uh, freebies that I that we got, and uh, I had a couple of surprises here. Uh, Bo-Katan, not really a surprise. Ten bucks, ten fifteen. Um, we got Wolverine in the uh, Marvel pack. Um, the Joker for sixteen. Okay, the video. Uh, I, I don't know how this works. I never really did the video boxes, but I opened up the box just to see what's in there. I'm going to say it's sealed because the bags are still sealed inside. But this turned out to be Slime Singer, which I don't know if it's a good one or not because it's 20 bucks. I was like, holy crap, $20. So there you go. And then uh, the tin, the metal box here, Lloyd versus Bone Warrior, $6.49. So. All in all, 10 items, 10 lots, 64, 90, well, I got a round, I mean, it's round, 64, 70. I just got to put them away and then I can upload it. That's pretty, pretty good for free stuff. There's always one winner and here it is. This is, I'm uh, trying to put the, the, trying to catalog this uh, lot of minifigures and yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's the winner. Good morning. It is Friday morning, March 15th, and uh, I just finished uploading uh, the minifigure lot that we got yesterday. I um, was about halfway through putting it away, and I just ran out of steam last night, so uh, I just finished it up this morning. 125 items, 111 lots. It came out to $145.34. That, I... It wasn't expecting much from that lot, and it turned into be like one of the best uh, value lots that I that I got. Um, I was very happy with that, and a lot more minifigures than um, like complete minifigures than I thought thought there'd be. I thought I would just be parting out a lot of those uh, 
um, a lot of those uh, like minifigures as parts. Hold on, let me see how many actual minifigures I got. We got um, 24 actual minifigures out of that. So that was that was great. Actually, minus three because I, I grabbed those out of I grabbed those out of the drawer there. I was looking for a part to complete uh, a minifigure. Actually, complete this minifigure. I had the torso, the head, and the helmet. I just didn't have the legs. When I opened the drawer, I had three complete of this, but no legs. So uh, I listed him since I already had had the listing up. Um, and then, yeah, I've got the torso, head, and helmet uh, for sale as well. So really good. Um, what was the other the surprising part? This uh, Commissioner Gordon, that is $26. Uh, I had another one of him already, so like it wasn't even a new lot. I, I have two of him now, so that's great. All right, let's take a look at orders. Orders were kind of light. Uh, Brick, Brick Owl sort of disappeared. Four orders uh, over uh, over the, the last 24 hours. 417 items, 105 lots, 135.64. Not too bad. In terms of value for the low number of lots and stuff and other than this for, first order which is a Republic Brits, Bricks order which is awesome uh, these three orders are very much all uh, minifigure parts orders and minifigure orders so they're low quantity low lots high value so very good let's uh, I need to get picking all right we got those orders out and we had one issue where uh, we had one cracked torso so I Give the refund, but sent the cracked torso. Anyways, we got two more orders that came in that are pretty small. Look at that, $73 for 10 items. Uh, that Kit Fisco sold. Look at that, how much, 30 bucks for him? $31, amazing. Uh, yeah, and then uh, I sold a uh, Animal Crossing's poly bag. That's the second poly bag from the um, uh, that I sold. I had a uh, Lego or a Technic forklift in the last batch, so they're they're starting to sell. But uh, we'll get these uh, we'll get these going. Uh, we'll get these out today as well, since it'll take maybe five minutes to get these put together. So I love uh, that's another ninety four dollars that came in. Good morning, Saturday morning. March 16th, I have got a live schedule in about an hour and 15 minutes, and I am uh, just sort of getting down here and to pull the orders, which is good because it is a slower day. Four, four orders, 436 items, 22 lots, and uh, 127, 26. Slow day, pretty good return. Not too bad. First one's $92.54. And then the rest are easy... Uh, Poly bag orders. So, yeah, let's get pulling. This first one actually has a note. Let me show you that first. Good luck with the full time Bricklinks tour. Enjoy your videos. Well, thank you. thank you very much for the order, especially orders like this make it much much more easier to run a Bricklinks store full time. So, wish we all had customers like you. Thank you. Good Monday morning. I hope everybody had a good uh, St. Patrick's Day weekend. We had uh, pretty good uh, corned beef and cabbage yesterday. It was pretty good, really good. Well, my wife did a good job on that. And uh, today we've got nine orders. Brick Owl, where'd you go? 72 items, 49 lots, 187.13. Not bad for the low number of items that we sold. But uh, yeah, we need that, need that a little bigger. 104, uh, what is that? $90 a day, not gonna cut it. Just not gonna cut it, but we should be able to get through this pretty quickly. Nothing has a lot of lots. That's probably the biggest one right there, the 10 lots. Yeah, no, 14 lots, 22 items. So that's it, all high high priced items though. So that's good. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. Um, over the weekend, I think I stopped, stopped shooting video Saturday morning. But uh, I did do a part out over the weekend. I did it slowly. Um, I gotta, I gotta get in the mindset of taking Sundays off because I just gotta do it. But Saturday I did the part out. 
Sunday I put it away and, and uploaded it. It was uh, 76278, which was a Marvel, um, Marvel, what is it? Rocket spaceship with Ronin in it. Uh, it's like a blue, orange, and white ship. And uh, let's take a look at what the part out. We did, uh, let's see, here it is right here. We did three of those and we uploaded 867 parts. 26 of those were new for $197.61, which uh, was probably a good two and a half, three, three uh, times part out for what I got them for. I think I got them on eBay too, if I remember correctly. Anyways, I'm gonna get going. I got these, uh, how many ever, nine orders I gotta pull. I'm thinking 20 minutes at most. It'll probably take me longer to do the shipping than it will to uh, pull all this stuff. So that's my hope. I just got a 10th order. I have not printed labels, so this one made it. Another $45. Smaller order, but nice, nice price. That brings us up to $230.75 in 53 lots. So 10 orders to do today. They just made it. And we're gonna print labels now. Order number 10, this is the one that just came in right before the label. I printed the label, so this is the bonus order. Has a note, I will promote your store on my Instagram page. I'm at underscore Lego Dad. We are excited to get these uh, Animal Crossing poly bags as my daughter and I are working on a creation for Brook World Chicago. Thank you, Dan. That's awesome. I'll take. A, I'll definitely take a look and uh, t take a peek. So a couple of heads, some arches, and uh, a couple of heads, 30 heads, holy crap. And uh, do I even have 30 of those? Oh, they're brand new. Where did I get those heads for th 30 of them? Anyways, and then uh, the Animal Crossing, they got two of those. The Animal Crossing poly bags have been really popular. I th this is the fifth one I've pulled in this string of orders so far. So, been awesome. Don't believe me, here's one, there's one, there's one, and then two for this order. All right, I'm gonna start today off with a small bag of uh, minifigures that I got, I don't know when. I got it a long time ago. They were sitting, one of the bags that were sitting way over there on that table, way over there. So, starting on that backlog. So we'll get that, uh, we'll get that going, see what, see what we gotta do there. All right, I got everything cataloged and put away and ready to upload. And I just wanna show you some of the winners that we, we came across here, we got the, Wonder Woman with dark red torso in dark blue skirt, eleven fifty-two. Spider-Man black and gray suit, ten sixty-eight. This one was a surprise. An F1 Ferrari driver, nine ninety-one. It has a stickered torso and a stickered uh, front and back, a stickered torso, which was amazing. Green Lantern, which I th I found was kind of funny. I haven't seen him in a while. Six dollars and thirty cents, and then uh, I don't think anything else really surprised me after that. Maybe this aim agent, which was four dollars and thirty thirty four cents, had a backpack with a couple of things sticking out the back. Um, yeah, nothing else really surprised me after that. Um, anything else? No, I think that's it. So seventy nine items, seventy three lots, one hundred ten dollars and eighty four cents. So not bad. All right, I took a lunch break and came back from uh, from that. And, uh, man, my lens is dirty. There, that's better. Um, yeah, so we are going to break into these two sets that we got on Friday. It is uh, the Ugly Chewbacca set. It's uh, 2,319 parts. I don't remember how many lots it is, but the number of curved reddish-brown and dark-brown pieces was high so uh just having two of these is good good enough right like there's probably uh you know like hundreds of these curved pieces that we're gonna we're gonna have there's gonna be you know some of the uh some of the base parts that are underneath the fur are gonna be uh you know single you know two pieces maybe but uh, a lot of the the reddish brown this is definitely a reddish brown restock uh, this is this is good for that. So we're gonna break into this. We're gonna work on this for the rest of the day. I think I doubt we'll get this uploaded though But uh, that's what we're gonna work on. Here's a mid part out update We've got all the browns on this table over here. We got the reddish browns and the dark browns 
and all the rest of the colors are on this table. We're doing the sorting here. We're watching, uh, we're watching the last episode that came out, episode seven of Halo. It's actually getting better. It's getting better, but still a little long in the two, a little long. We've got all of these bags yet to do yet. So, so quite a ways to go. I'm pushing through and got, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six more bags left. I couldn't tell if these were separate bags. Oh, they are. So five, five more pairs of bags left to do. Uh, but I am out of, out of cups again, of the small cups. And uh, so I'm going to have to buy another package. So 300 and, I think it was 309 lots. It is, and I ran out with five more bags left to do. So still got a lot left to do. I got black over here now because black was taking over a lot of this table. But what I've done is uh, <clears throat> sorted my sorted my file by quantity is two. So if there's two quantity, that means I'm not going to get any more. So I'll go through and I'll put everything away. What I, I'm using the marker column and I just put the word away in for all, everything that has two. And as I was going through and if I haven't gotten to it yet, it's still in one of those five bags. Um, I just removed the word away. And so now I'm ready to... I've got everything that I had, all the lots that I had already on the table. And uh, as I was putting them on the table, on the car cart here, uh, if I didn't have it yet, I would remove the word away from that. And so now I say marker contains away. So here are all the parts that are on the cart that have two quantity that are ready to be put away. Now, when I go to um, put away the rest of them after I get this all parted out, I can just say marker does not contain away and it'll show me all of the parts that haven't been put away yet. So, because I've come up with that in other other uh, part outs where I have to put some of the parts away and it became uh, a little bit tedious to try to remember, okay, well, this is two parts. Uh, did, did I put it away already or not this way? When I go through next time, I can just, uh, it'll, it'll save me time, believe me. All right, there is all of the cups that we uh, we put away, or we freed up. So hopefully that will get us through to the rest of the, the five bags. Most of the, the parts that I'm doing now are going into existing cups or existing lots. So hopefully, hopefully we'll have enough. Morning, it's Tuesday, March 19th, and uh, Monday was a pretty good sales day. Better than the weekend. Weekends have been crap for me lately. Monday through Thursday have been great. 11 orders. 824 items. 145 lots. $340.54. Usually the weekends are good, right? Like, what's going on? Anyways, I gotta get pulling. I got 11 of them. I figure maybe an hour. Maybe an hour. We got one really good order. Uh, came in late last night. $128, 437 items, 72 lots. That one will be a good one. Everything else is pretty pretty quick. 20 lots there is the other bigger bigger one. But everything else is like small lots, small items. Except for that one uh, order number 9 here. So, we'll get going. Yeah, this one also happened yesterday. I have consecutive order numbers. Two... Two four seven four five four one five, two four seven four five four one six. They literally came in right at the same time yesterday. Thursday morning, March twentieth. We've got four orders, nine hundred five items, ninety one lots, one hundred eighty four, ninety six. Not a bad day. Could could be better, but not too bad. Five hundred fifty five items, seven lots, one hundred seventy eight. 58 lots. Yeah, not too bad. Got all of the uh, Chewbacca's parts parted out, and I am starting to fill my cart up with parts. So I'm just going through, uh, starting at the bottom, ordered by uh, Remarks, starting at the bottom and picking them out. And then I'll go through and put those away. 
and then come back through and get the new lots. So, pretty time consuming. I wanted to get this done yesterday, and I just had a bad day yesterday. I just could not get motivated. Uh, I just uh, didn't get through all of the bags that I wanted to get through, and uh, yeah, just had a pretty bad day yesterday. So, today's going pretty good. I got my orders out early, and got the rest of the parts parted out, and now I just need to put it away. And it's noon now, so we're doing doing pretty good today. All right, table's all clear, everything's put away. And we're uploading. We are uploading 4,700 parts, I believe. And yeah, 4,700, 309 lots, $684.80 we upload. And we've got 63 new lots out of that, so. 2x to a little bit 2x part out but um yeah definitely a lot a lot of good parts added to the store it's thursday it's the first day of spring and uh yeah outside today is not very uh it's not very nice out outside today for first day of spring this is what it looks like outside right now it's 14 degrees with the wind yeah <laughs> he showed that to a uh, uh, Daddy O'Bricks, who lives in Florida, is like, what the heck? And I'm like, hey, you got to remember, the last snow around here is in May. So, there you go. It doesn't stick usually, but it, it does fall. Anyways, uh, so it's, like I said, it's Thursday. My wife has four jobs between today and tomorrow. And uh, she needs me for three of them. So, I am going to be pulling orders today and tomorrow. And that's probably about it. Maybe, uh... Do a, a few small things uh, after that but this afternoon she she's broke me in and then pretty much all day tomorrow she's broke me in so hopefully I'll even have time to pull orders so today I've got six orders uh, 705 items 124 lots two hundred nineteen dollars and fourteen cents uh, I got a nice order a nice message from the customer on this order uh, separately they are uh, a new seller who's watched the vlogs and um, uh, yeah, just uh, placed a nice nice order. It's all minifig parts. It looked like uh, when I when I picked at it. So that'll be fun to fun to pull. And uh, yeah, nothing looks super scary. Everything looks okay. And so uh, we'll continue on. Order number three has a note, and it says, Ralph, I love your YouTube videos. Best of luck. Well, thank you for the order. Thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. Thanks for coming and placing an order. Well, wait. This isn't the end of the video. There's more. We got to tell them about the society. Joining the Brick Separator Society gets you access to secret society videos like how to videos on how to run your business on BrickLink and Brick Owl and eBay, as well as Ask Ralph videos and maybe our sales reports. You might see all of our numbers. Join today.